In Connersville, police tell us they have a new plan now to fight heroin use, overdoses, and deaths in their community. And now they say several arrests prove that it's working. Eyewitness News reporter Naomi Peskovitz went to Fayette County, where police say they are off to a good start. The task force is now using this old state police post for its headquarters, and they've made some progress. 24 arrests in just the last month, but also in November, three people died from overdoses, so they're well aware there's a lot of work left to do. We'll go ahead. Um, do you guys have your notebooks? The House of Ruth is Connerville's success story, a sacred place, a 12 to 18 month program. You were an addict. Where former users go to look forward. Let me start with prayer. That like this young lady here. Sharon Cranfill opened the home almost five years ago. It's nationwide. We have a drug problem in the United States. And she's now on the Connersville Task Force to clear heroin from her town. You know, the rubber's meant the road here. We can't just say anymore, you know, we don't really have a problem, you know, it's going to go away. This is not going away. So we really had a problem going on. With so while police celebrated the two dozen drug-related arrests since their task force started, they also said the problem doesn't end with prison. We have to get into the homes. We have to educate the families. We have to get into the schools. We have to let them know exactly what this stuff is doing and what it can do to them. We did our drugs together. Former user Roberta Polly started using drugs when she was just 13. She came to the House of Ruth after her seventh time in prison. Sometimes jails and prisons ain't the answer. So, I mean, I want to see them to get the people help, let them know that, you know, that there is help and, and that they're serious out there. They're going to clean this town up. And she says word on the street now is that the task force is working. I ran into a few people and they're like, I don't know what you guys are doing up there, but uh, we can't get a hold of nothing. So that's pretty cool. The House of Ruth is making progress, too. They've purchased the home next door so they can help even more women. And they're working to bring a detox center to town. In Connorsville, Naomi Peskovitz, Channel 13 Eyewitness News.